It's a story that's truly out of this world. Navy ships and pilots capturing images about their experiences with what they claim are UFOs. This and night vision video shows three pyramid-shaped UFOs flying over the USS Russell off the coast of California in July of 2019. They reportedly hovered just 700 feet above the stern of the Navy destroyer. Other cell phone images taken by a Navy pilot flying near Australia in March 2019 show three unidentified crafts reportedly performing extraordinary capabilities like staying stationary in high winds. UFO sightings across the globe indicate the presence of other intelligent species in our galaxy, but it seems we lack proof to substantiate these claims. However, the chilling UFO sightings former Soviet astronauts have confirmed changes everything. The Russians have always had the upper hand in space exploration. With many successful space missions, Soviet astronauts have experienced the galaxy in shocking detail, but many of their stories have remained a secret for too long. It is time we reveal these mysteries and find out once and for all, is there life outside Earth? UFO sightings are a national security threat. Compared to the rest of the population, Few people can claim the honor of being an astronaut. However, that privilege comes with the scary possibility of seeing shocking things in space. In this video, we bring you former Soviet astronauts as they reveal the terrifying things they saw while in space. The Salyut 6 was a Soviet orbital space station, the eighth station of the Salyut program. It was launched on September 29, 1977 by a Proton rocket and was considered the first second-generation space station with record-breaking capabilities. The Salyut 6 witnessed a shocking phenomenon on May 5, 1981 that no one on board could have ever imagined. As the space station was orbiting around the Earth at an altitude of about 35 kilometers, two Soviet cosmonauts, Vladimir Kovalyonik and Viktor Savinik, were busy with their routine scientific research work. Suddenly, at around 11 a.m. Moscow time, Kovalyonik noticed an unusual object outside the porthole of the station. Because of the distorted way things appear in space, it was difficult for him to ascertain the size of the object and its distance from the space station. But he immediately noticed that it was a relatively large orange-colored object with a halo around it. The unidentifiable space anomaly was bright and glowing, making it even harder for the cosmonaut to understand what was on the surface. Regardless of his confusion, Kovalyonik knew that he was witnessing something extraordinary. Immediately, he alerted his partner, Savinik, who observed the strange sphere hovering outside the space station. The object was moving towards Salyut 6 slowly, as if it was assessing what lay in front of it. Both cosmonauts grabbed their cameras and began clicking pictures and recording videos of the mysterious space object. They also tried to contact ground control in Moscow, but could not connect to anyone on the other side. Meanwhile, the sphere continued moving closer to the crewed space station until it was only 40 meters away. The proximity allowed them to notice other details about the sphere, such as the grooves and bumps on its surface. As intrigued as they were, Fear was also slowly settling in since they had no idea what they were up against. Was it a UFO or an ordinary space object? Were they being approached by another intelligent life form? If yes, what was their intention? Suddenly, without notice, the sphere split into two, each about the size of a car. As the two smaller spheres moved away from each other, they went in opposite directions of the space station, only to become whole once more on the other side. The large sphere continued to split into smaller ones and rejoin again. This incredible process lasted for almost 10 minutes as the crew on Salyut 6 watched on in awe and amazement. The phenomenon they had just witnessed defied all laws of physics and logic, and it was unlike anything anyone had ever seen. Fortunately, there was more than one witness for this unusual event, or the entire episode may have been discarded as a hallucination. The space station tried to make contact with the glowing sphere that was dancing around their station a few minutes ago. The cosmonauts attempted to communicate using gestures and sounds, but were met with complete silence. And just as abruptly as the sphere had appeared near the porthole, it accelerated away from the space station, disappearing into the blackness of space. Stunned into silence, the crew members looked at each other in disbelief. Had they just encountered an alien spacecraft? The cosmonauts tried to reach out to their superiors on the ground again, but there was still no connection, even though all their instruments worked perfectly fine. 
Understanding the gravity of the situation, Kavalyonik and Savinik thought it best to remain quiet until they could speak to their superiors face to face. After all, getting ridiculed for UFO sightings wasn't uncommon, even for astronauts, and the cosmonauts didn't want to take any chances with their credibility being questioned. They did have evidence of the mysterious sphere, but the pictures and videos taken through the porthole were quite blurry. Also, it was impossible to replicate the clarity of human eyesight in space photographs. The crew continued its mission as though nothing unusual had transpired, but when they finally touched Earth base on June 9, 1981, they reported everything they had seen to the authorities. The superiors knew fully well the implications of such a discovery becoming public. Hence, they ordered the cosmonauts to keep it a secret. What do you think of the elusive sphere the Soviet spacecraft encountered almost 30 years ago? Was it really a UFO or another made-up story about alien existence? This wasn't the only time a Russian spacecraft encountered something unexplainable out in space. Salyut 7 also experienced something so extraordinary, they couldn't believe their eyes. Phi explanation. Perhaps the most curious among these incidents is what has become known as the Space Whisper. Cosmonauts Leonid Kazim, Vladimir Solovyov, and Oleg Atkov had been on board the Salyut 7 spacecraft for 156 days. The trio remained aboard for the longest period of 237 days. But they could have never imagined that entering their 156th day, they would witness an anomaly impossible to explain to their superiors on Earth. It was July 12, 1984 when the trio noticed a strange orange glow around the space station. They immediately thought of a gas leak somewhere within the spacecraft, but it soon became apparent that it was much more than an inconspicuous gas leak. Gradually, the whole station became surrounded by a thick orange cloud, and suddenly, the cloud took the shape of an unidentifiable object. This object emanated bright orange light that blinded all three cosmonauts momentarily. But once they regained their vision, they saw the most bizarre scene through the portholes of the space station. What looked like seven angelic beings were traveling alongside their spacecraft and continued moving with it for ten minutes. The cosmonauts couldn't believe what they were witnessing. How could it be real? When they reported the event to ground control, their superiors dismissed everything under the pretense of hallucinations. They argued the cosmonauts were oxygen-deprived and the pressure fluctuations of space had caused the visions. But how can more than one person hallucinate the same thing in comparable, glaring detail? The answer is simple. They could not. They were not hallucinating, but were silenced by authorities like all the others before them. Several Soviet astronauts saw shocking evidence of intelligent life outside planet Earth, but they were all silenced and prohibited from publicly talking about their experiences. One cosmonaut was afraid of the repercussions of revealing his name. Hence, he talked to the media anonymously. Let's call him Cosmonaut X for this video's purpose. Ever since Yuri Gagarin became the first man to reach space in 1961, cosmonauts, along with other astronauts from around the world, have had visions and experiences in space that defy explanation. Perhaps the most curious among these incidents. The story he told was so shocking that it was almost scary. Are you ready to find out? Cosmonaut X went on a space mission with another cosmonaut, and while they were in orbit, he heard someone whispering to him. It was as if something or someone was speaking to him inside his mind. You can think of it as a telepathic message. Only both the cosmonauts heard the same thing inside their heads. The cosmic whisperer spoke to cosmonaut X, informing him they were his distant ancestors. X's first reaction was disbelief, and sensing his hesitation, the whisperer spoke to him again, this time telling him things about his own family in the Urals that no one could have known. Once the whisperer was sure that X believed them, they told him to return to Earth and that Russia wasn't ready. Cosmonaut X was among the many who received this message, but others were too afraid to mention the event to their superiors. After all, everyone wanted to remain part of the Soviet space program, and any alien conspiracy could jeopardize their chances of survival. However, some cosmonauts did talk with each other, and that's how they found out that the Whisperer spoke to more than one person. Do you believe the Soviet cosmonauts? If they really did witness alien life outside Earth, why have they been forced to keep it a secret? Let us know your opinion on these space alien sightings, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also, smash the subscribe button and the notification icon to stay updated on more chilling space videos. Until next time, stay curious.